How to create anchor link in a Squarespace with a smooth scrolling. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I am going to show you how you can create the anchor link in a Squarespace with a very smooth scrolling from a space to another space or from a section to another section. It is very easy and simple. We have here two methods. Uh, enable to put or, or choose one of these methods. You are going simply to follow the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. Now we are on Squarespace as you can see and we have the website that we have created. I'm going to select or I have selected the website and I will net everything load up. Here as you can see we have the website that we have and from there we have some sections that I have on Squarespace. Now let's go ahead and select a uh, section that I want to add this method to. Let's go ahead and add or select the, uh, for example, this one. I'm simply going to click on edit. And here we have the website. As you can see, it is loaded. Now I have this section. Let's see here. What is the name of the section? We have the fall collection. Let's go ahead and add a block on the fall collection. And under that, I'm going to put a code. This code right here, I am going to click on the pen tool right here. Simply, I have a code to put it right here. It is a HTML code. I'm going to copy the code. I will link the code into the um, section or into the, um, the description. Here we have the div. ID equal here, your section name right here. I am going to name the section uh, I'm going to name it, for example, your collection, collection like that. I'm going to put this as a small letter. And here we have it. This is the code. And as you can see, we have the code. It did not appear. It is a full transparent, but you will see the magic happen soon. I am going back right here to the uh, first uh, or the first part of the website, I'm going to add a button on this header. For example, go ahead and add a block, click on it, and then we are going to add a button. Here for that button, I'm going to put, for example, I'm going to edit it, and here I'm going to put uh, C, for example, our collection. And here we have it, like that. Then I'm going simply to click on link. I'm going to attach a link and here we are going to put the magic key, which is hashtag. I'm going to put hashtag. Then I'm going simply to type collection. And here we are not going to open it in a new tab. And we will let it right here. Click on it and we have the link now. For this one, I am going to exit this code right here, click on see our collection and we will see where it will be guiding us. I will click on save here. I'm going to exit this mode and see where it will guide us. Click on collection. And as you can see, we have the full collection that was very easy and smooth. I will let you see again the process. Click on see our collection. Here it will be guiding you to the collection area. Here I am going to refresh the page. I have some difficulties with my internet and you will see the magic. Here we have the square website. Go back right here to the first step. Click on see our collection and it will be guiding you to the collection right away. Now let's go ahead and add another a scroll or a smooth scroll to another item click simply on edit and here I'm going to select for example a block or a section let's see here and I'm going to add this code in this area I'm going to click on add block go to code right here we have the code I'm going to place it right here uh, uh, near this sunglasses Click on edit with the pen tool. I'm going to delete that. Here we have this one. 
I'm going to name this section glasses. Glasses like that. Simply, I'm going to exit, exit this and we have the code. It is fully transparent. I'm going back to the home page. Now, I'm going to add a new block button. Put it right here, for example. I'm going to modify this one. Click on or see or explore. Explore like that. Our sun glasses. Like that. And simply we are going to click on attach link. Here we are going to make this as a URL. And I'm going simply to put hashtag and glasses. Glasses like that. Open it in a new tab. I'm going to deactivate this. And simply everything will be good. Here we have everything in order. Click on save. And simply we will exit this mode. Go back to the main menu. Click on it. And here we have it. It will take you directly to the sunglasses. This is this was very simple and very easy. And for the collection, it will take us to the collection right away. That was for the uh, scroll or smooth scrolling on the same page. Let's go ahead right here and make, for example, a smooth scrolling to a next page. I'm going to visit the services. And here on the services, I'm going to put, for example, a button or the I'm going to add the code right here. It is on the services and I'm going to add the code, add a block. Go ahead to simply not embed. It is not what I wanted to do. Add a block code. Modify that code. Delete everything here. Put your code. I'm going to put this into I'm going to name it services services like that put that code right here put it between the photo and the title go back click on save first then I'm going simply to exit this one I'm going to the website or the main page of the website then I'm going to click on edit again here I'm going to add a plug a new button put it here in the middle and now I'm going to modify this put services services like that attach link deactivate or before that I'm going to put something on the link I'm going to put or make uh, before that I'm going to click on here save I'm going to see the link of services, click on services. Then here we are going to see the link of it. Now I'm going to pages, see the services. I'm going to click on the gear icon and here we have the slug. Here we have the slug of services. It is a reverse slash and services. Then we are going to put it right away. Click on edit, go back right here on the login or the home page simply click on that and now click on edit modify this page or modify this button here we have to put the link here we are going to put the reverse uh, slash service like that or services services like that then i'm going to put the hashtag services services here we have it not open in a new tab let the code work and you will see click on services click first on save exit services and boom we have it now i am going to let you see a method without a coding it is very simple and very easy all you have to do is to download an extension called find squarespace ids or for find squarespace uh, ids or anything in this uh, context then you have this one when you click on it and install it you will see here the blocks ids that you have right here 
all you have to do is to select a block that you want to uh, go to for example and then we are going to copy the id of it let's go ahead and add uh, this block for example i have this block i'm going to copy the id of it simply click on it and it will be copied and then simply are going to click on edit here i'm going to hide these go back right here and i'm going to add a block button for example uh, with this button i'm going to add it we have a image for example i'm going to name it image and for the link click on attach link deactivate the new tab and simply you are going to put the uh, or paste the code that we have block number and here we go click on that and simply it will be good to go now we are going to click on save exit the edit mode click on image and boom here we have it that was all for today's video i hope you guys that you have enjoyed the content and hope to see you soon on the next one